Good morning on this nice sunny Saturday morning, a bit fresh in the UK guys. Um, right, we're going to go on about outer rings because if you are interested on the 2nd of March and 3rd of March, you will be able to uh, join one of their launch pads, what, what they've partnered with. So Game Zone, uh, BSE pad, Metapad, uh, I think this one's Cedar Fire, yeah. Um, and then join your relevant launch pad and participate in the IDO. Yeah, we'll go through uh, one of them in a minute. We'll go through Infinity's uh, uh, launch pad. We're going to talk about Axion and, and the uh, their launch pad. Uh, and at the moment, you've got about nine hours left if you want to participate in Legion Network. And we'll quickly go through Legion Network as well. Um, I think it's a promising project as well. Uh, and at the moment, you're going to get in at seven and a half cents. And when it launches, it's launching at 15 cents. So more or less, you know, launching double the price. Yeah. And then we're going to talk about warp as well. Um, so my suggestion is watch to the end. I'll try and get through all this as quick as I can. But each each project here, in my personal opinion, this ain't financial advice. Do your own research, due diligence. Um, I think in the long term, all of these projects are going to do fantastic at the end of the day. All right. So Out Rings is a massive multiplayer online role-playing game. Yeah, for anyone that doesn't know that. You can come over to it, scroll through, look at the beautiful pictures. It's going to be, in my personal opinion, a AAA game, guys. Yeah. Um, click on the drop-down menu here, and you can go to Virtual Reality 360. I've already loaded one up the top here, just uh, for speed, so to speak. As you can see, how beautifully uh, rendered this is. Yeah. Now, I don't know 100% the tokenomics at the moment. I've been super busy with, with a lot of the other projects that I'm in as well. And trying to keep up with everything that's out there is, um, yeah, it's a lot. But all I can say is um, I, I like playing online games myself. And it's absolutely fantastically beautifully done, this is. The other thing is the team. Yeah, I do like to look at um, who's behind the team, if they're doxxed. Uh, etc etc and obviously who's backing them as well and this is why I think Outer Rings could quite possibly be a very very big winner yeah as you can see you can scroll down here to the management now you might think ah they're not showing their faces but watch this voila scroll over them and as you can see Javier Javier he's on uh, LinkedIn yeah uh, Daniel CEO yeah on LinkedIn you can just scroll over these guys yeah and the development Point being easy is, look, you can see there's quite a lot. Yeah, game development, there's six just in the game development part of it as it is, like lead 3D artist, Fernando. So, yeah, again, keeping this a bit short and sweet, I just really wanted to bring out a rings to use, yeah? So, let's take, for instance, Infinity Pad, which is this one, yeah? As you know, with a lot of these launch pads, you need a certain amount of money, a certain amount of tokens, staking involved, um, and stuff like that. Well, with an Infinity Pad, you don't necessarily have to have the token. Staking, you have to do social tasks, yeah, but only up to 100 people can take part in this one. So it is like a lottery, yeah? And uh, you get 5% of the total pool. Now, just to go to the absolute basic one, which is a lottery, which means you may, you may not get in, You've got to buy 10,000 tokens and stake it for 30 days. And without going through that, this is roughly about $450 that you've got to do. So you've got to buy $450 worth of token. You may or you may not get allocated a spot for Outer Rings. Now, if you wanted a guaranteed spot, you've got to have 50,000 tokens. All right? Now, I'm, I'm in some launch pads myself, and I got in at super duper cheap prices way back in the day. Now, a lot, lot at the moment, obviously, with what's going on around the world, the like, for instance, Infinity and stuff like that, every, every, all of these launch pads have dropped in price a bit, but it's still quite expensive to get in if, um, let's just say, you know, if you ain't got a lot of money at the end of the day. The 50,000 tokens, so we go on CoinGecko. It's going to cost you $2,215 to get a guaranteed spot yeah, in uh, in the um, blah, 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 out of rings. Yeah? So what do you do? Well, you've got to make your minds up on that at the end of the day. Now, the tokenomics part of it, yeah, so the, um, get back there, tokenomics. So basically, we are at IDO stage, yeah? So IDO, 
Yeah, there's a total supply of, of 10 billion, what he's saying up here. Um, sorry if you can't read this. The IDO, initial DEX offering. Yeah, the, the to total token amount is 4, 4 million that, that's being released for IDO. Now, the vesting period, and in, in case anyone doesn't know what vesting means. So whatever money you put in, after one month or whatever the set dates are, yeah, you're going to get 10% every every month for 10 months until you get 100% of what you invested in. Yeah, now, this prevents um, Wales dumping it straight back on the market as soon as it launches, um, and etc. etc. Now, I think 0 0.004, so that is just under half a cent, I believe. Don't quote me on that, but... Uh, I hate all this double zeros here. They always get them muddled up, but I think this is just under half a cent. Yeah, could be wrong on that, but I think it's under half a cent. So, point being is, whatever money you put in, you'll get 10% month one, yeah, or, or maybe even as soon as it launches, um, and et cetera, et cetera, yeah? And then over the course of 10 months, yeah, so in other words, 10 months, whatever, whatever money you put in, you, you'd have the, the whole supply um, of the token uh, released to you. Now, um yeah as i said i'm not going to go for everything but you've got races there's a good story uh that's driven behind this you've got the earthlings you've got bayans but ends oracles uh scaven scaven guns and the mix you come over and have a good old read of this and the history part of it is as i said it's like story driven so if you could go to it and yet again i'm not gonna read all this because this would take about an hour and a half of, of, of uh this this youtube video here but basically, you can come over here. Not everyone expected the Outer Ring Civil War. Da, da, da. It's a very good read, guys. And a lot of a lot of effort has gone into this. And this is what I like to see when, when I invest in a project. Not just going into a project with, say, a slapped up one page, and that's the end of it. Yeah? There's a lot of effort being put into this. Yeah? So you've got the, the, the news, the races, white paper. Yeah, you can click on that and go through that. Now, the roadmap. Yeah, this is the bit that's interesting as well. So the the public uh, launching open beta is in June. Yeah, so we're not that far off. So we're going to be able to play this game, hopefully, in June. Yeah, open beta. All right. But this is where we are at the moment. So yeah, 2nd and 3rd of March is the IDO. So they're going to be listening on Pancake. Yeah, uh, the staking system, etc., etc. Yeah, so obviously you better stake your tokens and all the rest of it. Now in March, listing in a top five set. Six. Yeah. Centralized exchange, a top five. Yeah. So that that if if they really do this, this is gonna really, in my personal opinion, yet again, not financial advice, push the price up of this pretty quick. Yeah. They're gonna launch their own decks in April. Yeah. The marketplace in May. Yeah, so they've got their work cut out for them. Um, but as I said, launching open beta, and then after the open beta, um, you know, in September they they're housing, the housing and the lands are being done, and then you've got the uh, second uh, ring of Great Silver City, more planets being added, etc., etc. So it's going to be obviously um, added on, etc., etc. Yeah, very interesting to watch this one. Now, one big stipulation I will say: I'm not going to get into this on IDO. I just thought I'd bring this to you guys um, as uh, what's the right word? Because <laughs> it's second, third of March. Yeah. I will wait and I'm going to take my chance for a pump and dump because I don't want my tokens locked up for 10 months, to be honest, yeah, in this particular project. Um, and with the current market conditions, um, that's what I'm going to do. Yeah? As I said, you guys do you, I do me. The chances are I'm going to be kicking myself, but um, sometimes you've got to make a, a decision for yourself on what you think. Yeah. So anyway, so that's Infinity. Um, yeah, sorry, so we went through the Infinity one, what you'd need for that. Obviously, there are other launch pads that you can uh, go through. Come over, have a little play around with all the different VR settings in it, and come and check the team out, do your own research on it, and, and see what's what on that. Now, going on about launch pads, if, you've, if anyone has not seen my previous videos where, you know, I'm, I'm a great lover of Axiom, yeah, and please stay tuned, yeah, still, don't leave. So with Axion Launchpad, at the moment, you'll click on Launches, and these are Axion's previous Launchpads, and the one that's going at the moment, which is Legion Network. Now, you've still got 9 hours, 25 minutes on this one, and it's super, super duper easy to get into Axion's Launchpad. Right? You'll just come over here to it, 
you go into the accelerator you add some funds to the accelerator um, obviously first of all check the criteria for the actual launch pad itself um, and then I do believe it's uh, 5 million Axion staked for a minimum of one year now the current price of Axion and this is where we come to what I'm saying uh, for instance getting into outer rings you need say 2000 to be guaranteed an allocation well with Axion 5 million Axion at this moment in time is $138 guys yeah now yes you've got to lock it up for one year but you're gonna you're gonna accumulate accumulate there, 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 get my words out in a minute you're gonna accumulate additional Axion and wrap Bitcoin dividends at the same time okay so once you, you you'll be what you call in a stake in port world part here yeah and down here it would say wrap Bitcoins you're earning a bit of wrap Bitcoin and you're also earning Axion dividends now I must stipulate the uh, tokenomics of Axion at the moment and they're having a shuffle up with the team and stuff like that absolutely fantastic team yeah and I've been with them more or less from day one um, and some of the team from Axion have created Warp which we'll go through in a minute and oh, fantastic community I'm in lots of other projects guys but I'm always in, in Axion's Discord or Telegram and the same as Warp yeah great great fantastic community at the end of the day but getting back to the Longy so the one at the moment legion network so you'd come over to here launches yeah and then you could click on legion network and then it's going to take you to this page now first things first is do your research on legion network before you just chuck any money in yeah and then um if you want to participate you can click on here participate now but if we just go back one for a minute so once you've done your funding and you've done everything else yeah you then come over to here and you pledge so what you've done now is you you've you've done five million staked for one year so now you're eligible you then connect your wallet you come to where it says pledge now this is on the polygon matic uh network by the way guys yeah you have to do a, a kyc which is is very super duper easy and that is through um the securitants and Axion, none of the team members, no one sees your personal details. Yeah, but then once you've done that, you can come over to here, have USDC in your wallet. You might have to, uh, for a one, the, you know, one time, it's no fee or nothing, uh, just so your MetaMask accepts the USDC. And then let's say, for instance, uh, of, you, you, you want to put, say, $200 in, you'll come here, connect your wallet, and then you'll type in the amount you want to pledge, click pledge, and that is it so super super duper easy if you get stuck you just ask questions in discord yeah um or telegram and or you can come down to here the help this is 24 7 yeah and at the moment as you can see there's quite a few guys on here you've got pullen that's online at the moment and eskimo and i think this is mcmarty yes right so you've got three of these guys that are already here type in your question and normally within five six minutes they answer you if you haven't got telegram or anything like that yeah so price of axion at the moment um with the exponential moving average at the moment i'm waiting for this if this does a nice little crossover we're in we're in bullish territory in my personal opinion absolutely super super duper cheap at the moment um there's lots of announcements that'll be coming very soon and apologies if you can hear all that drilling going on um, that's one of the neighbors having an extension built on their property um but yeah so i'm super super duper bullish axion can't really go much lower than what it is at the moment uh my personal opinion yet again not financial advice to me the, this this is where you accumulate yeah and this goes for other projects as well yeah so moving on to warp yeah warp absolutely fantastic personal opinion again uh uh, uh, uh might have to pause this video if did i no, let's see, I've got my YouTube account up. Right, so let's go on to here. So yet again, Warp at the moment. Really, really fantastic. This is, yeah. At the moment, let's go to the map. So this is gamification. Basically, you can stake on Earth. You don't need, um, you don't need any uh, ship for this. So let's go to the stake part and it'll show you the APYs. So you can come to Earth. And at the moment you're getting APY of 125%. Yeah. So 
don't need no ship or nothing. Now, if you want to earn more, and obviously these do fluctuate as well, so you've got to calculate, do your own risk ratio and stuff, then basically what you do is you build a ship, you add fuel to it, and then you fly to the next planet. And then you stake on, say, proximity B. If you wanted a bit more higher APY, then more fuel, you've already got your ship, now you go to Medius. There is another planet unlocking very soon. I don't know the, the day it, they just announce it. <laughs> Normally uh, within a few hours, something like that. Yeah, so you have to stay up to date. Uh, you have to keep checking in Telegram and stuff like that. But Normally when, when the planet first unlocks, it's a race to get there because um, the last few planets, it started off with, say, 10 billion APY, yeah? So you've got to calculate how much warp you've got. It's no good flying from, say, Medius to the next planet and you, you only own $100 worth of warp. In my personal opinion, it's not worth it because, you know, roughly it's going to cost you $100 or whatever to get to the next planet. So you've got to make that $100 back on top of um, what you've got in there. Now, if you've got like three, four, five, six warp, and it's, it, the APY stays high, then, then it's worth it. Because the, the, the fantastic thing with um, warp is it auto compounds. And anyone that does know me, I love auto compounding. So you can come over to here, beautiful calculator here. So let's go. I'm actually on Planet Medius at the moment. So let's just say you only have four warp, all right? Just four warp. So at the current price of $180, yeah, so it's going to cost you in the region of $400, $560 roughly, yeah? And you've got that staked on there. Now, you're earning then roughly $4 a day. Now, bearing in mind, the price of warp is significantly come down at the moment, yeah? Um, as with current market conditions out there and everything else. Now, what Warp Bond is doing is there's going to be uh, ship battles, yeah? Um, they're, they're bringing out so much that, that, that will be added in, in what they call seasons, yeah? At the moment, we're on season one. When season two comes out, um, there's going to be other added stuff. You know, we've got ship battles, I do believe, that's still in season one, and I think this is what we're waiting on at the moment. So that's going to be interesting to see, yeah? Uh, and then obviously the next, pl next planet's unlocking and stuff like that. The, the, there's, there's so much that can be done with this particular type of project. Now, I'm not saying that they will, but I did do a bit of a suggestion the other night that maybe down the road, you will be able to be on one of these planets, park your ship, and perhaps um, they might be able to add stuff like um, you might be able to do mining on that planet to earn an additional APY or something, you know? Just an idea, and that's, you know, from me. Uh, but yeah, so at the moment, so this is all o compounding, yeah? So watch this. So let's just go to 30 days. It's just 30 days. So straight away now, in 30 days, if it stays at uh, just 792% APY, yeah? Your $721 is turned into $845. So you've earned $120. Now, but now let's go to 60 days. Yeah? So we've just doubled that. So let's go to 60 days. Now, you, now you're earning, yeah, now you've earned $991. Now, remember at day one, you was earning $4 a day. Yeah, so now let's go to 61 days. Yeah, go back. Yeah. You're, the auto compounding is kicking in. Yeah. So now you are earning uh, 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 $6, $6 a day at 61 days. Now, Let's scroll it up to let's let's get to 120 days. Now bear in mind I must stipulate the APY can change. So now we're looking at like 1300 and, and yeah, $1,362. That's just shy of three months. Yeah. Obviously, if it stays at this sort of APY. Yeah. But now look at on a daily ratio because basically what's happening is you're earning warp every day and that is compounding and you're earning interest upon interest upon interest. So we're at $1,362. Now let's go one more day. Now you're earning $8 a day. Yeah. If you remember, we started off just three months back at $4 a day. Now, bear in mind, this is only with four warp. Yeah. So now the crazy aspect happens. Now let's go up to 300 days, which is under still under a year. Yeah. Now let's go one more day. Yeah, so now we're on three thousand five hundred and thirty-seven dollars. Yeah, and you see that changing. 
So 537, now 556. So it's nearly now $20 a day, yeah? Now any any time you can unstake and, and take this money out, yeah? So that's the beauty of that. Now, obviously at the moment, guys, all, all, all that's happened at the moment is planets have come out, yeah? And they've done done the shipyard. This is fantastic. So if you want to buy a ship, you can come over to the, the shipyard. Yeah, you don't have to go on open sea. You can come here. Uh, you can go by the strength. Yeah, you can go by the price. So at the moment, the cheapest one out there is 180 die. Yeah, which is 180 dollars. Yeah. So uh, another thing to look at is the engine. Yeah, the bridge and the hull. So for ship battles, is the hull and the bridge. Yeah, as you can see, look, you want the strength. The bridge contributes to the strength. The engine contributes to the speed. So engine and fuel, the more fuel you've got and the your your engine, the higher number this is, you're going to get to a planet quicker. Yeah. So I think I've covered everything I need to today in today's video. Um one more thing. So um there is an AMA, uh not AMA, let me go. What one are we on at the moment? Uh let's go to warp. Today is 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 where's announcements uh i think five o'clock today and then i will try and join it yes today saturday at five o'clock yeah is um one one of the walk partners tomb finance yeah so come over to discord you'll just click on this link here and then you'll end up joining like a voice chat thing at the side if you're interested in listening to uh tomb, tomb finances um what they do yeah and also get to know some of the team and stuff like that yeah um also come and follow the social medias and stuff like that with axion you've got axion token aka uh, superman uh you've got myself you've got fixation uh you, you've got just so many people that it's, it's it's you know too many to to list but i do believe uh fix will be doing um his saturday live tonight uh yeah again in my description I, I i've got links to to fixation and stuff like that and axiom token and all the rest of it but i think we'll leave it at that guys um yeah so check all of these ones out and uh as I always say be lucky in crypto and peace out